As we navigate the complexities of modern life, it's easy to feel disconnected from the divine. In a world filled with noise and distractions, it's hard to hear the whispers of the divine. But what if we told you that there's a way to tap into that divine guidance and stay connected to the divine? That's what we're going to explore in this video. A divine revelation is a profound experience of connection with the divine. It's a moment of clarity, insight, and understanding that transcends the ordinary. In this moment, we're able to see beyond the veil of the mundane and connect with the sacred. It's a moment of profound peace, of reassurance, and of guidance. In this video, we're going to explore the concept of divine revelation and how it can be applied to our everyday lives. We'll delve into the stories of those who have experienced divine revelation and how it has changed their lives. We'll also explore the ways in which we can cultivate a deeper connection with the divine and how we can stay connected to God even in the midst of chaos. But before we dive into the specifics, let's take a step back and consider the concept of divine revelation. What does it mean to experience a divine revelation? How can we tap into that divine guidance? And what are the benefits of staying connected to the divine? Throughout this video, we'll be exploring these questions and more. We'll be sharing stories of those who have experienced divine revelation, and we'll be providing practical tips and advice on how to cultivate a deeper connection with the divine. So, if you're ready to tap into the divine guidance and stay connected to God, then let's dive in. As we navigate the complexities of the political arena, it's natural to wonder how faith plays a role in the decision-making process of our leaders. The relationship between faith and politics is a delicate one, with many leaders struggling to balance their personal beliefs with the demands of public office. For President Biden, faith has been a constant source of strength and guidance throughout his life, shaping his values and informing his policy decisions. As a devout Catholic, President Biden has spoken publicly about the importance of his faith in his life, often citing the teachings of the Bible and the guidance of the Holy Spirit as a source of inspiration and wisdom. His faith has also been a source of comfort during times of personal struggle, including the loss of his son Bo and the challenges of being a public figure. But what does this mean for those who may not share President Biden's faith? Can people of different religious beliefs or no religion at all still find common ground with a leader who is deeply committed to their faith? The answer is a resounding yes. While faith may be a personal and integral part of President Biden's life, it is not a prerequisite for connection or understanding. In this video, we'll explore the ways in which faith informs President Biden's leadership and what this can teach us about staying connected to our own faith journeys. We'll also examine the ways in which people of different faiths or no faith can still find common ground with President Biden and engage in meaningful conversations about the issues that matter most. As the world continues to hold its breath in anticipation of the next move of President Biden, it's crucial that we take a step back and reflect on the role that media ethics play in shaping our understanding of the man behind the mic. The 24-hour news cycle can be a double-edged sword as it allows us to stay informed and engaged in the political process, but also risks perpetuating misinformation and sensationalism. In the era of fake news and alternative facts, it's more important than ever that journalists and media outlets adhere to the highest standards of ethics and integrity in their reporting. A simple example of this is the concept of confirmation bias where a reporter's preconceived notions about a particular politician or issue can influence their coverage and lead to an unfair or inaccurate representation of the facts. This can be particularly problematic when reporting on political leaders, as it can have far-reaching consequences for their reputation, their party, and even the country as a whole. By staying informed and critically evaluating the information we consume, we can stay connected to the truth and avoid being swayed by the whims of the media or the political winds of the day. And as we continue to navigate the complex landscape of politics, it's essential that we prioritize media ethics and seek out sources that are committed to fairness, accuracy, and transparency. As President Biden navigates the complex landscape of Washington politics, it's natural to wonder how his faith plays a role in his decision-making process. 
In an era marked by polarization and division, the relationship between faith and politics is more crucial than ever. For the president, his Catholic faith serves as a guiding light, informing his views on issues such as health care, immigration, and social justice. For many Americans, faith is a deeply personal and meaningful aspect of their lives, influencing their values and worldview. In this era of political turmoil, it's essential to recognize the significance of faith in shaping our leaders' perspectives and actions. As we navigate the complexities of modern politics, it's crucial to understand how faith can serve as a unifying force, bridging the gaps between different ideologies and political affiliations. When we stay connected to God, we are reminded of our shared humanity and the importance of compassion, empathy, and love. These values are essential for building a more just and equitable society, and they can be a powerful force in shaping our political decisions. As we strive to stay connected to God, we are reminded that our political differences are not insurmountable, and that we can work together towards a common good. As we delve into the mysteries of the divine, it's essential to understand the concept of divine revelation and its significance in our modern world. Divine revelation refers to the idea that God communicates with humans through various means, such as dreams, visions, and prophetic messages. This concept has been a cornerstone of many religious traditions, allowing individuals to gain insight into the divine plan and guidance for their lives. In today's fast-paced, technology-driven society, it's easy to become disconnected from the spiritual realm. We're bombarded with information, stimuli, and distractions, making it challenging to quiet the mind and tune into the whispers of the divine. However, this doesn't mean that divine revelation is obsolete or irrelevant. On the contrary, the need for guidance and connection to the divine is more pressing than ever. In this age of uncertainty, many people are searching for answers, seeking a deeper understanding of their purpose and place in the world. They're craving a sense of meaning and connection that transcends the mundane routines of daily life. It's in these moments of vulnerability and longing that divine revelation can be a beacon of hope, providing individuals with the clarity and direction they need to navigate life's challenges. As we explore the concept of divine revelation and its relevance in the 21st century, we'll examine how this ancient yet timeless principle can be applied in our modern lives. We'll delve into the ways in which God communicates with us and how we can cultivate a deeper sense of connection to the divine. As President Biden takes the reins, it's essential to take a closer look at his stance and policies to gain a deeper understanding of his approach to governance. One of the most striking aspects of President Biden's leadership is his unwavering commitment to upholding the values of the American people. His administration has been characterized by a sense of unity and inclusivity, with a focus on healing the nation's deep divisions and promoting a sense of shared purpose. From the outset, President Biden has made his intentions clear, pledging to restore the integrity and dignity of the Oval Office and to prioritize the well-being and prosperity of all Americans. His policies have been shaped by a deep understanding of the country's complex challenges, from the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic to the pressing issues of climate change, economic inequality, and social justice. Throughout his career, President Biden has demonstrated a remarkable ability to bring people together, to find common ground, and to craft policies that benefit the many, not just the few. His commitment to transparency, accountability, and good governance is unwavering and his leadership has been marked by a sense of calm, measured, and thoughtful decision-making. As we navigate the uncertain landscape of the present, it's reassuring to know that President Biden's steady hand is at the helm, guiding the nation through uncharted waters with a firm grasp of history, a deep understanding of the American people, and an unwavering commitment to the values of justice, equality, and freedom. As we conclude our journey of exploration, it's clear that the intersection of faith and politics is a complex and multifaceted topic. While the idea of a president dropping out may seem like a dramatic turn of events, it's a reminder that even the most unexpected twists and turns can be a catalyst for growth and reflection. In the midst of uncertainty, it's easy to lose sight of what truly matters our faith, 
our relationships, and our connection to something greater than ourselves. In the midst of the chaos and noise of modern politics, it's easy to forget the importance of staying connected to our faith. Yet, it's in these moments that we're reminded of the power of prayer, of community, and of the divine guidance that can guide us through even the most turbulent of times. As we look to the future, it's clear that the role of faith in politics will continue to be a topic of discussion and debate. Whether we agree or disagree with President Biden's stance on faith, we can't ignore the profound impact that faith has on our lives and our world. So let us take a moment to reflect on the importance of faith in our own lives and how it can guide us in our own journey of discovery. Let us stay connected to the divine and let us remember that even in the midst of uncertainty, we are never alone. As President Biden navigates the complex and tumultuous landscape of American politics, he is faced with a multitude of challenges that threaten to derail his vision for a brighter future. The nation itself is grappling with a plethora of issues that have been decades in the making, and the weight of these problems is palpable. From the pressing concerns of economic inequality and racial injustice, to the ongoing crises of climate change and healthcare reform, the president's plate is overflowing with the weight of responsibility. Furthermore, the president must also contend with the increasingly polarized political landscape, where division and discord seem to be the only constants. The constant din of partisan rhetoric and the growing threat of disinformation can be overwhelming, making it difficult for the president to find common ground and build consensus. Add to this the ever-present specter of international tensions, and it's clear that the president's task is nothing short of Herculean. Despite these daunting challenges, President Biden remains resolute in his commitment to the American people and his vision for a better tomorrow. His unwavering dedication to the principles of justice, equality, and compassion is a beacon of hope in a world that often seems to be spinning out of control. As he faces the challenges that lie ahead, the president is armed with the wisdom of experience, the strength of his convictions, and the unwavering support of the American people. And it is this prophetic word of assurance that gives us hope that, despite the odds, President Biden will stay the course and lead the nation towards a brighter, more prosperous future. As we conclude this prophetic word of assurance, it is clear that the Lord has spoken a word of encouragement and guidance to President Biden. Despite the challenges and uncertainties that lie ahead, the Lord has deemed it necessary to remind us that He is always in control and that His plans for America will come to pass. In His infinite wisdom, God has seen fit to give us a glimpse into the future, revealing that President Biden will indeed stay the course and fulfill his duty as the leader of the free world. This is not a word of prediction, but a word of assurance a reminder that we are not alone and that God is working behind the scenes to bring about His will. As believers, we are called to trust in the Lord and His sovereignty, even when the road ahead seems uncertain. We must continue to pray for our leaders, just as the Bible instructs us, and trust that God is working out His plans for our nation. In the days ahead, we will face challenges and obstacles that will test our faith and resolve. But we must remember that we serve a God who is greater than any obstacle, and that He has promised to be with us every step of the way. So let us stand firm in our faith, and trust that God will see us through even the darkest of times. This prophetic word of assurance is not just a word for President Biden, but for all believers who are called to trust in the Lord and His sovereignty. May we be encouraged to stand strong in our faith and to trust that God is working out His plans for our nation. As we conclude our exploration of the prophetic word of assurance surrounding President Biden's commitment to his vision, we hope that you have been encouraged and inspired by the message of hope and resilience. Despite the challenges and uncertainties that lie ahead, we believe that President Biden's unwavering dedication to his principles and values will guide him to stay the course, leading our nation towards a brighter future. May this prophetic word of assurance be a source of comfort and strength for you, and may you be empowered to stand with President Biden as he navigates the complexities of leadership.